there's nothing to stop anyone from reaching the sky. For the first time in the history of the Sri Lanka Air Force, Pilot Officer ADPL Gunaratna and Pilot Officer RT Viravardhana became the first female officers to be awarded the prestigious flying brevet and become pioneering female military aviators in Sri Lanka. Pilot Officer RT Viravardhana also created history when she was awarded the prestigious Sword of Honor for Best All-Round Performance. This prompted me to look for male-dominated careers where women had made inroads into and I came across the profession of air traffic controllers. Currently in the US, 33% of air traffic controllers are women and pretty much the same percentage is maintained in Sri Lanka as well with 21 of the 86 air traffic controllers being women. So, I checked with air traffic controller Sewandi Karuna Naika on what the job was like. First, it was actually a male-dominated uh, profession, but uh, very recently, more female uh, air traffic controllers are joining the uh, trade. I am a graduate from Peradhan University, a physical science graduate. We had to go through uh, several tests, about five of them, any aptitude test and things like that. Aptitude test and a voice test and anything. They check uh, what you know, a multitasking ability of uh, of a person to get into this job because uh, one, uh, we have to switch between the jobs very quickly. Striking the balance between the personal life, my family life and uh, the job, my career was the biggest challenge. Technology is key in moving forward to transform every challenging moment into a profit where manual becomes digital business becomes smart and lives become smarter. People's Bank Online Corporate Banking. It's truly the change you need.